And it's a pleasure this time around to have a classic soul video join us in studio, Mr. Eric Benet. What's going on, man? Hey, not too much. Welcome in. Thank you, thank Welcome you. In. It's been a few years. I know you meet a lot of people. Got a chance to talk to you in New Orleans at the NBPC. Okay, and, that was a minute ago. Uh, yeah, that was, that was quite a couple <laughs> couple hits ago. Uh -huh. And uh, you had a couple albums, and you, you seemed to disappear for a while. You know, you, you, you were, of course, married to Halle Berry, got divorced, and, and uh, kind of got away to do your own thing, so to speak, writing music. Yeah, man. Feels good right now, man. It's uh, just spent a little time uh, working on putting this record together and putting it together the right way. Love and life is in stores right now. Um, had a great first week. Uh, the first single, You're the Only One. This is the third week at number one. So I'm just grateful, everybody out there. Thank you so much. And thank you for all the love I've been getting at radio. And, you know, it's um, the whole idea behind the record was to make a record that felt like the kind of music that made me want to get into it. The game, and, and this was actually the first time where the record label gave me. They just kind of wrote me a check and said, "Here, go make your record." Yeah. So um, having that much control just felt good. Yes, from start to finish, about how long did how long were you working with that? I mean, if you there was a lot of start, stop, start, stop. But if you just put all the time I worked on the record together, it's probably about five months. Okay. Yeah. That's not bad at all. On your out in Los Angeles now, still. Yep, yep. It's just my daughter and I. We live in uh, L.A. and uh, that's what I was going to ask. Now you're you're really working. You were on the Tom Joyner show. Mm -hmm. You're on the Monique show. Yeah, man. You're on the Today show. Yeah, bro. And, and then yeah. <laughs> you're working it. Uh, along the line, you said you, you, your daughter. She's 16, getting ready to drive. You, you're going through that now. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, she, my daughter India. She actually did the uh, the Today show with me. So, okay. So that was fun. It, it just flew her out to New York with me last week and. She sang background with me okay. uh, on NBC, and that was nice. That was real nice. Now she's aspiring to be a singer as well. Yeah, she's very talented. She's okay. she has a, a beautiful voice, and she plays the guitar and arranges music, and I actually have her singing uh, background on one song on the record, a song called "Still I Believe." Okay. And, um, and it doesn't hurt to have dad as one of one of the top writers and producers in the in the business in R and B. Well, it, it was it was a great a great another great bonding experience for us. It was her first time in the studio. And um, you know, her first time her vocal was produced, but was by Dad, so that was, that was kind of cool. Yeah. And for those who don't know, you originally started in Milwaukee. Mm -hmm. It was originally uh, you had the group Benet, which That's was right. you, your sister, That's and your right. cousin. Oh, you went back. Yeah, I, we, we do our research here. That's we try right. to do our research, uh -huh. but. The video for you are the only one. It looks like you went back to Milwaukee. I went back to Milwaukee yeah. and shot the video on the street where I was born and raised. It oh, was really? real cool. You could just see uh, in the video the camera just pans around and uh, see a lot of the old faces and old you know people that I grew up with. And um, we set the band up on that block like a full band with the horns and all that. And, Got my sister singing background too. Oh, really? So it was it was a really emotional. Experience. She's in so she's in the video there. My sister's okay. in the video on stage singing background. Yeah, my okay. sister Lisa. Now, did you film the the hungers in the next single? That's right. Did you film that in in uh, Milwaukee as well? I did. Okay. I did. That uh, that was just all part of that same performance. Okay. And uh, yeah, it was. It's always it always feels good going back home. That's that. that's why I want to ask how how do people? I'm sure they receive you well, but did did you find any? That didn't receive you well, or did they mostly just receive you well? Nah, it's just all love. Oh, you know, yeah. I'm just, I'm just grateful, man. It's like, um, you know, I guess uh, I've been getting back what I've been putting out, man. I've just yeah. been putting all my love and all my soul into this music, and what's been coming back to me is just, uh, you know, uh, appreciation and love. So yeah. I'm, I'm really grateful for that. Well, we've missed you, and we're glad to have you back. The new CDLP is Love and Life. That's right. Uh, any. Any uh, any uh, movie, TV you did? You were in the movie Glitter with Mariah Carey, weren't you? Why'd you have to bring that? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, you had to start somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> start no, nah, that was cool. That was actually a, a fun a fun experience for me. You know, just being on the set. And, yeah. But um, I actually I actually been uh, working on a screenplay over the past few years, and I just. I'm just kind of wrapping it up right now, and hopefully, if all goes well, next year I might, you know, take it to the next level uh, okay. for a film. So, okay. Um, aside from writing music and being daddy, that's been taking up most of the time. All right. Well, we wish you the very best of luck. Thank you for stopping by. Oh, and man, my pleasure. Anytime. Anytime. All right. Classic soul video, Mr. Eric Benet on the show.